It's Calgary's podcast on the Canada's Podcast Network. Hello, this is Mario Taniguzzi from Canada's Podcast Network. Joining me today is Shelley McGregor, founder of Apex Therapy. Thanks for joining us today, Shelley. Hi. Hi. Let me ask you a little bit about massage. Why, you know, why should, uh, or maybe start with, what are the benefits of massage? You know, I think there's been a lot of um, scientific research now that tells us the benefits of massage therapy. I think that uh, I've been doing massage for 25 years and I think it was pre-scientific and I think what we saw was, uh, I can ha actually say by personal experience after an injury that I sustained, I was in a wheelchair and a back brace for three months um, in my 20s and my surgeon had said, you likely won't run again or you'll walk with a limp and I personally had physiotherapy and massage therapy push me to the limits um, and push the tissue to the limits of healing and I think that there's the only reason I was able to run again or run a half marathon when I hit 30 was because of the hands-on tissue work that I had. Um, massage therapy for me really does help tissue heal um, post-injury, post-chronic injuries, uh, in repetitive strain. I think a lot of people that sit at their desks and have neck pain, um, shoulder pain, it's really something that we've seen over and over again is the success our clients find through massage therapy and hands-on treatment. What are the factors, I guess, that uh, maybe prevent people from coming to see a massage therapist? I think there's still a lot of people that have never had a massage. We see them all the time, booking in and unsure. Um, and I think that the prevention is just, our people are resisting because they don't know what to expect. And for us, it's people that they come in, we have them complete a health history form, um, we review their concerns, we address their concerns during that treatment. Their body is never exposed, they're fully draped with a sheet and blanket. The only part that we're treating is exposed. Um, so it's very private. I think that there's a lot of people that are unsure of what massage therapy is all about and how personal it is. So I think that they may think that uh, it's not for them or that it doesn't heal them um, or it won't help them. And I think that really more and more people have started to experience the benefits of massage therapy. So there's hundreds of uh, massage therapists in the city. Um, how does someone like me as a consumer come to the decision of who to phone and, uh, and uh, uh, get treatment, I guess? Mm, I think, you know, when I start thinking about how most of our new clients find us, it's by word of mouth. Um, and I don't necessarily mean social media. I mean clients that have been here, have experienced um, a true therapeutic massage and have told their friends and family and then they are safe to come to a clinic that has a high reputation. Um, I really believe that is our still our number one source of new clientele is existing clientele. Um, the next one would be internet and I think that that is because you see the reviews. So Facebook 4.9 out of 5, you see Google reviews, you get to read people's actual experiences um, and then because we're so centrally located I think that's probably why we see about 200 new clients a month. Okay, great. Thanks for joining us today, Shelley. Thanks for having me. I'm Mario Tanaguzzi with Canada's Podcast Network.